Today we're checking out SML Movie Junior's loyalty test. Let's dive right on in. Alright, Kraus, today is the last day of school before Christmas break. So we're gonna have a free day. Today. Break. Free day? No work? Oh hell yeah. Dude. I always get like a half yeah, day like break, uh wrong. I used to no, get a I half didn't. day. That's how you spell break. It's spelled B-R-E-A-K. That's how like you spell break a bike if you break. broke something. This is how you spell break if something is stopping, like how a car uses its brakes to stop. This is a Christmas break because we are stopping school for your Christmas vacation. Oh yeah, that works, but okay. okay. I'm the teacher, Cody, not you. The teacher is always right. But you're wrong. Alright, Crass, that's it. Since Cody <laughs> wanna be a smart ass. You're gonna have homework over Christmas break. I'm gonna go prepare a packet. Good going, Four Eyes. Yeah, you flippin' nerd. Sorry, guys. Whenever someone makes a spelling mistake, I have to just keep pushing and pushing until it ruins everyone's day. I freaking <laughs> hate you, Cody. You freaking <laughs> freaker. I want to frick your mom. <laughs> you nerd so, emoji. Nelly, what do you want to do during Christmas break? Other than a shit ton of homework. Sorry. Well, Junior, I was really hoping we could spend time together on Christmas Day. Oh, uh, well, do you, like, want a Christmas gift or something? Because I haven't got you anything. Yeah, I want a Christmas present. I well, got you something. Junior, Christmas is in less than a week. Well, the stores are still open, so I can go get you a gift today. What do you want? I really want something, but it's really expensive. What is it? A Harry Poopon necklace. Harry Poopon. What the fuck? You been my nigga? What's a what? Rich? What's a Harry Poopon necklace? Junior, Harry Poopon is the most name brand show up Harry expensive Poupon. necklace there is. All the white girls want one. Yep. Well, how expensive is it? Well, in funky rap terms, shit, about a band or two. Sounds about right. Lil Wayne did say I'm richer than a bitch without the Harry Poopon. Yeah, he did say that. Lil Wayne does love Harry Poopon necklaces. One to two thousand dollars for a necklace? You don't have to get it for me, but I really want it. And and think about this, Junior. If you got me something like that, I could like never break up with you. Cause what other boyfriend could get me something like that? Hmm, hmm. I mean, you could never break up with me. I saw Richard on the thumbnail. I know where this is going. Ugh, so much homework. Thanks, Cody. Sorry. I threw much shit away, dude. I'm not doing homework also, uh, on Christmas. I see oh, multiplication I tables, to right. be fair, so oh, I could do it. Look at these Harry Poupon necklaces. Uh, Junior, you're not actually going to buy one of those, are you? I might get her one of the cheap ones. Like, look, this one's only $930. Dude, you can't see that pebble. It's so small. She's not going to like that. Well, how about I get her the $2,500 one? How are you going to even afford that? I was thinking I could steal my dad's credit card and buy the necklace and hopefully he doesn't see the charge until after I give her the necklace. But, but by that time, she'll be my property. Junior, you're not going to own her just because you bought her a necklace. She said if I buy her this necklace, she'll never leave me. Dude, she's not an indentured servant. Yeah, she can say anything. Hmm. It doesn't mean it's true. She could still leave you. Well, I'll tell her, look, I'll only give you this necklace if you sign this contract saying I own you. Okay, well, even if a she agreed to do that, it's not I legal own, to own a okay. person. Well, what stupid idiot would make that rule? Abraham Lincoln. Why'd he do that? <clears throat> oh... oh. I guess he, he made freed the slaves. I guess? What do you mean? I guess we just guess it now? Look, let's just go back to the Harry Poupon. So if I buy her this necklace, it would be stupid because she could just leave me anyway? Yes. Okay, so then I should test her loyalty before I spend so much money on a Christmas gift. What, how are you going to do that? I'll hire a really hot guy to ask Penelope for her number. And if she gives her number, she's a cheating bitch and I won't give her the necklace. Ooh, I like this plan, dude. I don't hmm. know. This doesn't seem fair to Penelope. Not fair. All if right. she gives her number, she's a cheater. If she says I have a boyfriend, then she's loyal. What's not fair about it? Well, what if she gives him a fake number? That's still cheating because it's, uh, you're entertaining it. Yeah, of yeah. course. If she gives the guy a fake number, the guy might think she made a mistake and said, ooh, she got a number wrong. She really was into me. She saw my, my wiener imprint in my pants and she liked it. Yeah. Yeah. That doesn't hmm. seem like cheating to me. If a girl asked me for my number, I would say, I have a girlfriend, I'm loyal, go away. Because that's my boy, he loyal. Mm -hmm. Junior, you mm -hmm. would not say that. Well, that's because we're dogs. You know, we're just trying to get our next bone. Oh. Yeah. Oh. If you know, a girl asks for our number, we're going to say yes, especially if it's a oh, 10 out of 10, Coke bottle shaped ass, busting out the frames type bitch. Well, hey. that's why it doesn't seem fair to Penelope, because you're getting a 10 out of 10 guy to ask her. Well, girls should stay loyal, Cody. So, so I think I should do this. I'm going to hire a really hot guy to see if she'll give her number away. Okay, well, who are you going to hire? Oh, dude, I know the perfect guy. My homeboy, Stanley. Man, he pulls off. Stanley? He has seven on his roster right now. Is he hot? Bro, he fucks. Keeps his dick wet. I'm telling you, smooth as butter. Real player made ass nigga. Look, we went to a party one time, and I had this girl. She was 11 out of 10, bro. She was really feeling me. Hot as hell. But then I walked away to get a drink. Next thing you know, she's upstairs with Stanley getting it on. You you can't hey. leave him alone with a girl for longer than 30 seconds, okay. bro. Yeah, he picks pockets pussy, has sleight of hand, bro. Oh, juggernaut, bro. He has oh, really? every perk available. Wait, why have I never heard of this guy? Because he likes vagina, Cody, not penis. Look, I'm going <laughs> to get him real quick. 
Uh, Junior, are oh you boy. a little worried Let's about see the Stanley? Stanley? He seems a little overqualified for this job. He might actually steal your girlfriend. Well, that's what I want. I want a guy so hot that she would cheat, so I know not to buy her this necklace. But I don't think it's just going to be a job. Over a necklace? He's my man, Stanley! Stanley is dead. Oh, you mean Stanley. Hey, Stanley, we've heard so much about you and your penis. Mm. What's up, guys? Where are the women at? That's my boy. <laughs> man, he stay on the prowl. He can't be hey. stopped. That's him? Oh, yes, he is him. Timothy, Mr. Metal Detective Dick looking for the hoes. So, Stanley, I like your shirt. Thank you. It stands for equality, which means any girl can get it. I like fat Asians, lardy Latinas, obese white women, and big booty black bitches. Hey. All of the above, my boy. <laughs> well, he knows his you, women. Stanley. And it includes women, so don't be nervous. Okay, what is it? So I have this girlfriend, and I want to see if she would cheat on me. So I want you to go up to her and ask for her number. And if she gives you her number, then I know to break up with her. Okay, can I pap? I mean, you can do whatever you want. I just want to see if she'll cheat on me. Oh, I guarantee she'll cheat. Yeah, my boy guarantees it. It's hey. in the fine print. Yeah, so where is she? Okay, so here's the plan. I was going to call her and tell her to come over here until I was hanging out with you. And then I was going to go use the bathroom. And then while you're alone with her on the couch, that's when you ask for her number. Okay. All right, so Cody, Joseph, you hide behind the couch. Okay, I got you. All right, I'm going to call Penelope. So, Penelope, meet my new friend Stanley. So. Hi. Oh, man, my stomach hurts. I gotta go use the bathroom. I'm gonna leave you two alone. You would never cheat on me, right? No, Junior. I'll be right back. So how's it going? Good, just hanging out. All right, I only have a shirt on. Wait, oh. do you have a mustache? Yeah, I'm not wearing any underwear. How old are you? 15, you should totally lift up my shirt. How do you know Junior? Oh, today. What? That doesn't what? answer my question. You're really pretty. Can I get your number? No, I'm not comfortable with that. She must have put up some sort of dumb bitch force field that prevents me from getting her number. I can hear you. Time to go to plan B. Do you like oranges? Yeah. My balls are the size of oranges. You should totally squeeze them. Okay, you need to leave. Uh. Well, I got seven other women that would totally be happy to squeeze them. And five of their hands are on my shirt right now. Great. Well, go call them. Go. <laughs> you are, know what? I think I'm are they all... Oh, weirdo. Are... <laughs> so, they're actually when Stanley asked for your number, what would you say? I told him no, but Junior, how did you know he was going to ask for my number? Uh, I didn't. Guys, you can come out now. Why are your friends hiding behind the couch? Nah. We were playing hide and seek. I just gave up. So, Cody, when Stanley asked Penelope for her number, what would she say? Well, she said no. Did she say she had a boyfriend? Not exactly. Did she say she had a boyfriend? No. We have to break up. Junior, he's nah. your friend. He should know I'm your girlfriend. If a guy asks for your number, you're supposed to say, no, I have a boyfriend. Go away. You invited me over, and before you walked away, you asked if I would ever cheat on you right in front of him, and I said no. Hmm. Hmm. Okay, go to your house. Let me think about it. Uh, Guys, did she seem interested when Stanley was talking to her? No, not at all. Yeah, something was off about her. She seemed weird. Yeah, it might have been a pH balance or something. You said hmm. Stanley pulled hose. I mean, he usually does. He has like a 99% return rate on him. Guys, I think maybe there's just something return wrong rate, about Stanley. I, mean, I think that like was maybe it. Maybe he only likes fat girls. Huh? What makes you say that? Well, he only mentioned fat girls, and it seems like that's the only way a guy as weird as him could get that many girls. I ain't gonna let you talk bad about my homeboy like that. Yeah, obviously Stanley gets hot girls because Joseph said he stole his 11 out of 10 hot girl. Yeah, I mean, I mm. did say she was bad, and I meant like 11 out of 10 on the fat scale. That bitch was huge. Ah. A brick house. I'm talking about bad cholesterol, goddamn. Look, Damn. any day she could eat a Debbie cake and be in the grave. I'm talking about heavy breathing, all that shit. Woo! Yeah, she Ooh. was thin as hell. Well, I guess that answers that question, Junior. I don't think Stanley was a good enough test to see if she would cheat. We need to get yeah. a rich guy, because girls will cheat for money. So we have to get a rich guy to come up and offer her money to cheat. Richard. Like a prostitute? No, 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 no. Like, we need a guy to come up to her and say, you're the type it's of girl that's going to wake up on a yacht every morning. Um, he's and then, on the boom, thumbnail. Give her $1,000 see if she cheats. It doesn't seem fair to use money. No, if she's going to leave me over money, then I don't want to be with her at all. Junior, it really seems like you want her to cheat on you. Yes, I want her to cheat, because I can't afford that necklace. So let me go call Richard, you know, our rich friend. Hmm. What do you poor kids want? Well, Richard, you have a yeah. lot of money, right? Yeah, my name's Richard, not Portrait. I'm rich. <laughs> okay, <laughs> so I have this girlfriend, and I want to see if she would cheat on me if you gave her money. Well, of course she'll cheat on you if I give her money. She's a woman. She loves money. Okay, <laughs> She's a woman. You I think you should go up to her and say, hey, baby, I'll give you $1,000 if you make out with me right now. Or I could do this. I have an even better idea. Cody, pick a number between one and 10,000. Well, I got to go with my favorite number, five. Okay. All right, check your phone. Okay. Uh you just Apple paid me five dollars. Oh shit! I, I mean, I mean, my favorite number is five thousand. That's what I meant. Too late. Oh, God damn it! Uh, I didn't know money was involved. Fuck. Well, yeah, go up to her and do that. Well, I'm not gonna just give her free money. If you want me to hmm. do it, you can give me the money and I'll do it. I don't have. I mean, it's five dollars. Well, it's no deal. better than oh, okay, nothing. I got an idea. There's this really expensive necklace that she wants, so I can go steal my dad's credit card, buy the necklace, give it to you, and you can give her the necklace to see if she would cheat on me. Okay. Okay, let me go get my dad's credit card and buy but, it. But Junior. Uh... 
Okay, I just got back from the Harry Poupon store. This necklace was like $3,000. My dad's gonna beat me up when he sees his credit card statement. So here's what's You can just happen. give her I'm the necklace. Be over. I'm gonna leave her alone on the couch and you're gonna walk up to her and say, hey, I just bought you this Harry Poupon necklace. Make out with me and see what she does. Okay. All right, Cody, Joseph, you hide behind the couch and you, you take this. All right, Penelope, just sit right there. Junior, what's going on? I have to use the bathroom, my stomach hurts. Again? Uh, hey. Hi. I got you this necklace from Harry Poupon. Oh my God, really? Yeah, it's all yours. Oh my God, thank you so much, it's so beautiful. Yeah, you wanna make out? No. You don't wanna tongue my hairy mustache? What? Ew, no, go away. Oh, fine, poor. Creep. Okay, my. Penelope, I'm back. Wait a minute, where'd you get that necklace from? Oh my God, Junior, this weird kid with a mustache gave me this Harry Poupon necklace, and then he asked to make out with me and I told him to leave. Just you say Merry Christmas. You from another man, we're breaking up. No, Junior, this is great because now you don't have to give me this necklace anymore. But I got you that necklace. No, you didn't, Junior, that creepy kid did. No, I did, Cody, get in here. Yeah, Junior, I was gonna warn you, if you're gonna get her the necklace, you should just give it to her yourself. Now she thinks another guy gave it to her. Well, tell her I got it for her. Yeah, Penelope, he bought you that necklace for the other kid to give you. This was just another test to see if you'd cheat. Yeah. What? Well, I think you're gonna cheat on me, so I hired two guys to see if you'd cheat on me, and you didn't. Well, I didn't, so now what? Well, now you have the Harry Poupon necklace. Merry oh, Christmas. Really, Junior, thank you so, 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 so much. I'm never, ever, 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 ever gonna break up with you. So does that mean I own her now? No, Junior. Junior, you <laughs> oh man, my dad sounds yeah. pissed. Uh, Santa Claus, all I want for Christmas is my dad not to beat my ass. Junior, you ran the charges on my credit card. Oh, I'm gonna beat your ass. No, someone save me. Oh, 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 oh. Uh, Santa Claus. Santa. I asked Santa Claus, the only thing I wanted for Christmas for you not to beat my ass. Oh man, I guess I can't do it now. But I uh, can. Three thousand dollars on a necklace. I'm gonna beat your ass red like my rosy cheek. Oh. Oh. Beat his ass, Santa. Beat his ass. Yeah. <laughs> what is your favorite Christmas movie? Well, yep. Yeah. Oh, oh, oh. <laughs> it's the next video. It is the next video. That Nightmare Bonnie looks so creepy, man. And I'm actually going away on the 22nd, so uh, unfortunately, I can't watch the video. Um. Until the two, uh, until the twenty fourth, so I won't be able to watch it until Sunday. So uh, you guys are gonna have to wait two more days if you guys want me to react to that video. Um. Anyways, this one was all right. Um. At least, uh, yeah, Junior got the necklace, and uh, did he somewhat get a good ending? Well, technically, with Santa being his ass, not really. But at the same time, he did get the necklace, so I gotta say, he got a neutral ending. Hey guys, click on this video. You'll enjoy it. I swear.